title refers to uh, why uh, these airmen in the uh, guys in the Air Force why they're fighting, fighting right. for uh, soccer moms to protect their their women and uh, for a chance to 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 uh, operate the drone, which is called a Reaper, which has two 500-pound bombs and plus missiles. So it's very awesome. When I started writing this play, in my first draft, all, all this was new and, and it was kind of like the things that I was writing um, weren't, didn't happen yet. And then they happened and I'm like, oh well, missed that. But it's so, uh, the, the, the uh, topic of operating drones and fighting a war this way, it's not really made it into the main consciousness of America. And it needs to make it there. I mean, <clears throat> we, we need to decide about this and, and we need to have some experience of what, what it is. When, when the images from Vietnam came back into America's uh, uh, um, TV sets and their living rooms, people saw that. They were like, what the hell are we doing? When, when that, uh, that uh, Viet Vietnamese officer shot that guy in the head, was like, what are we doing this for? Or is this why we're doing this? But, and uh, and uh, the, the, uh, the military learned a valuable lesson. Don't let people know what the hell they're doing. Um, and so, uh, you know, I, I tried to write this play so that I could reveal some of that and let people have an experience of that uh, as best I could. And, and to be an exciting and fun and enjoyable experience but then to be able to, to think about it. I, I don't consider it to be an anti-war play, in, except in so far as it, it truly shows something that happens. And then, if you watch that, then me, I would say, oh, war, this is wrong. But it doesn't necessarily mean it is. Uh, uh, that for everybody they'll come to that conclusion. I try to just present the things that are there, you know, uh, and, and let people draw their own conclusions without hiding anything. And I try to present the uh, players. I, I put this play up for, uh, for uh, a contest, and I got feedback from the people and said they didn't know who the bad guy was. They needed a bad guy. I didn't want to have a fall guy in this. I didn't want to have a straw man. So I didn't make it like, um, you know, uh, where, where you, you, you got to hate the guy. That, and so uh, I tried to show people who honestly believe they're doing a good job, they're doing the right thing, and, and, are, and have reasons for that, and to show their reasons and to put them in the best light that I could. One thing uh, that's really been interesting is, um, you know, I spent so much time in the script. I, I, I had reasons for almost everything, in, you know, that, I mean, precise reasons why this word, not that word, etc., and all that. I can't remember them. But the actors find them. And that's very interesting. It's mm -hmm. like, oh yeah. And I give a, a direction, or well, let's, why don't we do it that way? And they say, yeah, but the script has this, you know. <laughs> and I say, oh, that's why that is. We get so much reassurance that this is going great, and we're, we're you know, we don't have, you know, uh, it's not indiscriminate what we're doing and, and all this. And it's that, oh yeah, but we have no uh, person who's watching this who doesn't have a, a, a horse in the race. You know, we, we only have the reports of our intelligence. Our intelligence 
tells us to bomb these places, and then our intelligence says, oh yeah, we bombed only those places and only these people. Um, and when something uh, comes out, uh, they get squashed and, and people get uh, 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 all threatened and different things for reporting that stuff. I mean, they've uh, both, both sides. The thing about war and the thing uh, is that both sides have an interest in perpetuating the war. It, both sides really don't want to win. If they can't have an overwhelming victory and have it over, they want, don't want the war to go over because that's what their power, their power is in the, in the war. So um, they don't want people to really know what's going on. That's up to them. You know, my thing is, I, I hope to, to make people, I hope to entice people, and this is, you know, seduce people by this great show into something happening inside themselves. And, and what they do with that is, is totally up to them. Uh, I heard an interview with uh, Albi, uh, uh, Edward Albi, um, Oh, in the last, sometimes in the last six months, and and he said, um, well, if it gets people talking, that's the whole point. And uh, so, so that's how I, some something similar to what I consider important.